trading, tech reviews, how to's, and much more. Hey guys, so today we are going to show you how you can clone yourself within the Wondershare Filmora right. video application, video editing application. It's really easy to do, but the first thing you need, obviously, is you need a camera or some kind of uh, smartphone. I'm using a smartphone. I'm using my iPhone 6 right now. And you also need a tripod because you need to make sure that is perfectly stable. And let me show you this picture right now that I'm using, this tripod. I'll put a link below where I got it. It's on Amazon. It's really inexpensive. I use it all the time. Um, now... The other thing that you need to do is record a video Both on the right the side, side and the left side. You can make two individual clips or you can do what I do and I'm kind of lazy. Just make one video clip and then cut it and then you have two clips right there. All right. So why don't we go ahead and uh, get started. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that. Uh, somebody actually commented on my channel and asked me to show how to do a clone. So I did it within one hour. This was my uh, first try here and everything went well. And I'm going to show you what I did. Now, first thing to just take note is, you know, I only did a duplicate, but you're actually able to do triplets as well. So you can basically clone three of you used two, but for this video I only did two. Um, now, you know, typically what you want to do is you want to shoot two clips, okay? However, what I do is I just shoot one clip and then I can just go ahead and cut it. It's just easier for me this way, um, you know, as soon as I'm done with the left side of the video, I can jump right to the right side and get everything done in one shot. It's just easier, it's faster, I think. You also want to make sure that you have like a tripod like I mentioned in the video. So if you look in the link below, I did a uh, another video on the tripods that I have. It's really inexpensive and it's definitely, uh, definitely worth it. But for this cloning, you definitely need a tripod because what you're doing is you're creating a picture in picture, a pip. So basically, if you like, you look right here, like it's basically splicing uh, two videos together so the middle part has to be exactly the same so you can't have any kind of movement in the background or anything so as soon as you record yourself on the left side and the right side of the video you want to go ahead and import it and you just click on file go to import media then click on uh, import media files find your video and then go ahead and import it okay so here is the original clip here and let me go ahead and play the original clip for you so you can see exactly what i did and um i'm gonna go ahead and fast forward a lot of this too okay so let me go ahead and start this hey guys so today we are going to show you how you can clone yourself within the wondershare filmora I'll go ahead and fast forward this. Record a video on the right side and the left side. You can make. Oops. Okay, so you can see me moving right. over. Just like that. and the left side okay so you can see um, actually I spoke on both of them so you really have to line it up pretty good okay or is this it's just not gonna it's, it's just not gonna make sense so here's the original clip that I did this is one whole clip so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drag and drop this onto the timeline and then what I got to do is the first part I'm going to keep me on the left side here and then I'm going to go ahead and cut it when I'm on the right side like over here and then what I want to do is I want to keep the left side of me on this line here and then when I'm on the right side I want to bring that clip 
down here, this line down here, which is re, uh, basically the pip, the picture in picture. Okay. So first thing is this. Let me go ahead and try to find where I end with my left side. Okay. Okay. So I can let me move back a little bit more now. Okay. So I'm pointing right there. Let me just press on play really fast. Okay. And that's fine. I can go ahead and cut it here uh, because I can always go back and trim it later. So I want to give me a little bit of leeway like in the end part and the beginning part. Okay, so I'm just going to go ahead and cut it right there. It's fine. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to right click on here where I'm getting ready to switch over to the right side. I'm just going to delete this whole entire thing. Now I'm going to grab that same original clip and I'm going to drag and I'm going to drop it right here. Okay. Now what I would do with this one is I want to save the part where I'm on the right side. Okay. So here's me on the right side. Let me just press on play really fast. Okay. Let me just move it back right here. Okay. This is good. I'm just going to go ahead and make sure it's, it's highlighted. You see the blue line here? It's highlighted. So let me go ahead and cut that. And now I'm going to go ahead and delete this left part. And you know, let me move this over a little bit more. So I definitely gave myself some leeway in here okay, before the video started and also on the very end too. I'll have to trim this or cut it down here too. So what I want to do now is just let me do this. Let me go ahead and drag it all the way over. Okay. And okay. So I have the top part highlighted. Let me highlight the bottom part. That's the picture in picture because what we're doing is this, this first part right here, is going to be on the left side here and we're basically splicing these two together okay which is a pip a, it's a picture in picture should be called like um, VIV video in video but it's PIP picture in picture anyways what I want to do now see if, if I go ahead and play right now it's not going to do anything see it's showing me on the left side right now hey guys so what I need to do right now is highlight the one that's on the pip line, right click, go to green screen, then you want to tap on mask, and then from here you want to scroll all the way down to the very bottom. And basically we want to look for the ones that are half, so you can see both of these. So go ahead and like double tap on this one. Okay, you don't see me in here. I should be in there because you know I started the video with me in there. Now let me try this this half here. Hey, there you go. Perfect. Let me just press on play a little bit. Okay, and also here you have options over here. You can kind of like move this around. You can play with this. Uh, also the height here. If you move the width down, then you're able to move this part too. Like this. So, but basically if you picture yourself um, you know, perfectly on the towards the left side of the camera, the first time, the second time, do it on the on the other side of the camera. You know, don't ever cross this middle line right here, okay? Because then your hand or whatever is so just going to disappear in there. You have to make sure the lighting's pretty good too, because if the lighting's like not on point, a lot of times you can see, or e even if shadows, make sure there's no shadows, because the shadows will disappear once you start going through here, and the lighting should be perfect too. That's why I, I, I like to do uh, one video shoot, you know, but there will be times where the lighting's a little bit off and you'll see like a line like down the middle, like the color of the wall will be different than the other side. Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, just okay this and then I'm going to go ahead and play it and see how this sounds, okay? And remember, like, like I, I'm speaking in this one too, so they have it has to correlate. So let me just press on play. Hey guys, so today we are, we are going to show. Okay, so I cued myself here when I gave me the hand signal. So I know that, um, you know, as soon as he, um, my left side gave it the hand signal, my right, my right shot, right side should have been at, you know, within like a couple seconds at that same time. So what I know what I have to do here is. Let me just go ahead and move this one over like this. And then let me start on this. And I need to cut this beginning part. 
So let me press on play. Okay, so I start talking here to move over a little bit. Let me press on play again. Okay, I get ready to say hello. So let me go back a couple frames like that. That's fine. Go ahead and cut it right there. Now I'm going to go ahead and delete this last clip or this first little clip right here. Press on delete. Then let me go back over here to this part and then press on play. Okay, so what I want to do here is I want to move back a little bit, or I, I can move over here. Just move back a little bit right here. And then I'm going to go ahead and cut it here. And then I'm going to delete this beginning part. And now let me move this back. And let me. Oh, yeah, then every time I do this. Oh, hold on. Hey, guys. So, so today. Okay, so you see. Uh, wait, let me go back again. Hey guys, so so today. Okay, so actually, I mean, what I should have did was I should cut this a little bit more, this second part here. So you can see that the second part, the pip here, it's highlighted right now. Can okay, you see the blue line around it? What I want to do is cut it like a little tiny bit more. Okay, wait, I start waving here. So just let me go back like a second. All right, let me go back a little bit more. Okay, right here is good. So this is highlighted now. So if I use the scissors, it's going to cut this one that's in the PIP, okay? So now I want to delete this little tiny piece in the beginning. If it's hard for you guys to highlight it or something, you just go up to the timeline here and you can like move it over. Everything is a little bigger. Now it's easier to see. Now let me go ahead and delete that. Now let me move it back. And now I'm going to press play again. Hey guys, so... Oh my goodness. I can't believe I did that. Let me go back again. Press on play. Hey guys, so today we are going to show you how you can, can, can clone yourself within the, within the one... Okay, not sure if you guys caught that, but I cut too much of it, okay? So let me just go ahead and click on the backspace here. Okay. So, I cut too much, so I need to cut a little bit less. Actually, you know what? Let me just bring it back here again. Let me press on play. Hey guys, so today... Okay. right there is perfect. Today, we are going to show you how you can... You can... Clone, clone yourself... Self within the Wondershare, 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 Wondershare Filmora, Filmora video application. Okay, that's perfect. So, let me go to the end here. Let me rewind a little bit. Uh, get started. Okay, I mean, I mean that still works too. This is not as good as the original one that I made. But from here, what you can do is you just go ahead and you cut. Now, see there's a little bit on the end here. I, I don't want to see me getting ready to get up and move over. So I'm going to cut it right here. Now I'm also going to cut the same spot on the second part. So I'm going to highlight this down here, and then I'm going to go ahead and cut it. Then I have two places I want to delete the, the ends of both of these clips. Okay. So I, both of them are highlighted. I'm just going to delete them. And both of them will disappear. Now I did do another thing in here too. I threw a picture in there. I'm not sure if you want to. That's not really a big deal. But since I put it in there, I'll, I'll show you how to put that in there. It's basically you have to make a third pip. Okay. So let me just press on play and figure out. Where exactly I mentioned about that tripod picture? To do, but the first thing you need, obviously, obviously, is you need a camera or some kind of a sm a smartphone. I'm using I'm using a smartphone. Smartphone. I'm using my iPhone six right now, and you also need a tripod. 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 Because you need to you need to make sure that is perfectly stable. And, and and let me show you this. Let me show you this. Let me show you this picture right. Okay. So I mentioned about the picture now, and the picture is right here. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to drag and drop it on to the next pip line, okay? And just ignore the stuttering, it's just computer is slow. It's really starting to uh, irritate me. But let me just move back a little bit more and I'll press play. This picture right now that I'm using, this tripod, I'll put a link below where I got it, it's on Amazon, it's really inexpensive. 
I use it all the time. Um, um, um. Now, now. Okay, so you pretty much got the picture. But yeah, definitely uh, look at that link in the description below where I have, uh, I go over a couple of the tripods that I have. And if you guys want to know how to do anything else in, want to share, feel more, just comment below. And if you subscribe, share, like, I appreciate it. All right. Thanks, guys. Good night.